Hi guys, it's Michelle and I'm here doing my 33 week bump date. Um, I'm feeling a little bit better, which is awesome. The Unisom and the B6 complex is somewhat working. I am only um, barfing once a day now, which is awesome. Go upstairs if you want to watch Super Bowl. Go. Sorry about that, but um, so that's awesome because, but I still like keep getting where I'm like lightheaded and just don't feel well and can't stand for very long and like my whole body gets like this weird overwhelming energy feeling. I don't know, it, it just sucks. I think it's my like blood sugar or blood pressure or one or the other because it happened in the beginning as well. So that stinks. I'm not able to do as much or very much at all, really. Like, I can't clean like I normally do, which sucks. Because, like, you know, sometimes, I don't know. I just like to clean some. I like stuff to be clean, and now that stuff's not as clean, like, I haven't mopped the floors or swiffered them or swept them or anything. I at least vacuum at least once a day, but, like, I don't know. It just sucks because like then you get more anxiety because it's more dirty and then I don't know it's never ending but it's okay. Um, uh, I have my ultrasound tomorrow which I am nervous about because I'm still measuring over two weeks bigger. This is the third time I've measured two weeks ahead and so um, I guess since I'm 33 weeks now I'm over 35 measuring over 35. So I don't know if, and I'm not supposed to be nervous and then most likely nothing's wrong and it's just normal or something. But I've never had like a bigger baby. I've had, my son was 7'7 seven, seven, and my daughter was 6'5. So I don't know. I don't know. It's just very nerve wracking because I'm just scared. Uh, I don't know why I'm scared. I'm just nervous that I have like too much fluid. Shh. I love you that I have like too much fluid or I don't know because last at my 20 week ultrasound she measured 19 weeks so then at 25 weeks I measured 27 and then so far every time two weeks ahead still so I don't know how in like a month she gained three weeks on her if not more than three weeks which is like okay is there something please stop okay I love you too but I don't know and so, and then I keep getting, like, I've been having pains in my, I guess it's called lightning crotch or something. But I have those, and sometimes it's like a constant cramp, which is scaring me. But I know that since I have my ultrasound tomorrow, they'll be able to measure, I guess, like, your cervix, like, everything. I don't know. I've never had one past 20 weeks. So it's kind of, I don't know. I keep saying, yeah, it's kind of scary. Well, I don't, I shouldn't be scared, but. I can't not be. I've tried and everything will be okay. So that's good. Um, and I have been able to keep stuff down more. I said that kind of. I now weigh 157.6. Kind of 158 sometimes too. Which is good because I started at 153 and then I got down to 145 because of all the nausea, which, well, not just nausea, all the vomiting and not being able to keep stuff down and. All that stuff. So I've gained back the eight pounds I lost plus some, which is good. But I'm also started a little overweight because I'm only five three and I started at one fifty three. So technically, like I'm obese or something. I don't know. Um, I think that's really about it. I'm just nervous, and I just keep saying that um, that I had the lightning crotch, and then I have Braxton Hicks too, and I just get worn out really easily. I guess it's because it's my third pregnancy. Because the, the other two, like, I felt like... I look back at it now and it's like, okay, maybe I was really tired too. But I still feel like so exhausted now. And it may be because I have a four-year-old and a two-year-old that need me all day long. 
because I am a stay-at-home mom, so I don't know. And that's what the noise is, is Mila. <laughs> and uh, I guess now I just have to do my measurements, my belly. And that's all I have really to say. And um, I guess I might update tomorrow after the ultrasound. I don't know when we get results back. They, she said, like, no phone calls, good. But, like, for me... <laughs> I would rather just know, like, hey, everything's okay, or hey, everything's not. Like, because I don't want to wait, because I don't even know if she's going to get it, because tomorrow's Friday, and my appointment's at, like, 1.30. So she could get it not Friday, and then I think the whole weekend everything's okay, and then Monday she's finally getting the ultrasound stuff, you know? I don't know. I overthink everything, but it's okay. But, so here is the belly at 30. Three weeks. It's nice and big, and uh, I think my belly button is pretty much almost flat now, especially after like at, at night time. It gets a lot smaller. I mean, flatter. Like. So, 32 and a half. Yeah. 37. And then under here. Thirty-eight and a half. and well, that's cool. Not bad at all. Here's my, I will later. Here's my bump. We'll close on. So, um, I guess that is all I have. Um, thanks for watching. And if you haven't already, please like and subscribe to my channel. And I'm trying to make more videos and just make more friends. and. I don't know, have fun. And I do live in Colorado. So, yeah. Say hi. Say hi, crazy hair. No. Okay. Can you do this at least? I will measure you if you do this for me. Whoa. Do a thumbs up for me. She has a finger. She has the... Oh, now she's backing away. Oh, that's funny. Okay, well, thank you for watching. I hope you have a good day. Bye. I also wanted to add that my cravings are sweet stuff and carbs, like pizza, but like homemade pizza, or like a Papa Murphy's vegetarian pizza with artichokes on it, and vegetables. Like, the other night I had just zucchini, fried, not fried zucchini, but a zucchini that you slice up and you put parmesan and a uh, little bit of herbs on it and then olive oil and then you like kind of cook it in the oven for a long time and then they kind of crispy and they're still somewhat laced off but they're so good. So those are my cravings and then sweets, it's pretty bad like chocolate and uh, like cinnamon rolls and donuts, oh my gosh donuts are so good. Um, What else? Uh, yeah, because I had the zucchini and an artichoke with butter. It's so good the other night. Um, and then I like, I don't know, it's just vegetables and sweet stuff. And then pasta and bread. So it's all the really not good stuff for you, but it's okay. But I just wanted to add that. Thank you.